if i want this whole page translated all i have to do is to click on this translate that we went to do it now look apart from using our normal translating apps like the high dictionary and the google translate in order to translate our want to see it app i'm going to be sharing with us a different way whereby you can be able to translate your 1688 app completely into from chinese to english right so before you can be able to do this particular trick that i'm going to show us in this particular video make sure that your 1688 app is linked to an alipay account 1688 app should be linked to your alipay account before this particular um, this particular trick that I'm going to wear that I'm going to be sharing with us is actually going to work so without wasting much time hit on the like button also hit on the subscribe button to join the happy family let's get right into it okay so here we are on my Alipay so you're going first of all going to open your Alipay account as I have done and you're going to click on account So you're going to click on account over here. Once you click on account, you're going to click on your settings at the top right corner over there. Okay. All right. So once you click on this particular um, one, you're now going to click on this general over here. Okay. So once you click on this general over here, you are going to click on translation to okay all right so you just wait for it to load up okay so once you have once you click on this translating to okay now check over here this translating to it should be on okay once i click on it like this you can see it's off once i own it you can see it's on right so this is how it's supposed to be that will show that your translate your translate your, your translating tool is on right now when you come down you are going to um to now select the language that you want to um to be translating your 1688 app to okay so you want to translate it from chinese to what language so you want to translate it from chinese to english or you want to there are other um other different languages okay so these are the languages that they support so if you want to change it to french to can easily change it from english to french so all you have to do is to click on this french over here and it's easily going to change it to the french language right so once i have clicked on all right so once i have clicked on my translating tool and my translating tool is on okay so i'm going to go back okay so i'm going to go back to the home page okay so i'm going to go back to the home page over here and i'm going to click on the search bar at the top over here all right so once i click on the search bar at the top here i'm going to click i'm going to type in 1688 okay so once i click on 1688 i'll just click on the very first search that this is going to give me all right so once i click on this first one i'll just click on 1688 all of us know how our 1688 mini app looks like like this is how our 1688 looks like right so I'll just click on one six eight eight. Okay, so this is actually my one six eight eight app. Okay, so once so far as your one six eight eight app is connected to your Alipay account, once you come here, this account is currently my one six eight eight account. Okay, so now if I want this whole page translated, all I have to do is to click on this translate that we went to do it now look at how it is going to it's going to work okay so can you see that so as i am scrolling down i don't need to come back and click on translate again every single thing is going to be translating immediately english um chinese are, um, appears is going to change it to english for me anyhow at all that i want it is going to translate every single thing over here okay so can you see that so this is how you can be able to change your once is 80 so let me click on one particular item but one thing i realized about this particular this particular trick is that um it doesn't come with the with the camera icon okay it doesn't come with the camera icon but apart from that every single thing is working on this particular platform as normal as it can be 
so just as you can see right can you see that um, it's working that is just it so immediately the english uh, the chinese appears it by itself automatically is going to change it right yes these ones wouldn't because they are graphics okay the reason why these wouldn't is because they are graphics right but apart from the graphics any other thing at all that you want to read over here can you see that everything at all is going to be translated to you for you to actually understand so this is it so i'm going to start this store because i feel they have very good stuff okay okay so that's you know basically very very simple this is the simplest way you can be able to come over here and as you are here you can be able to play somebody will be like can i place orders here you can do everything that you want to do over here okay so let me try to place an order let me try to place an order so that you see how it is once you link your one to say take to your alipay as you are over here everything is there your shipping address like your own account is cloned inside this particular one can you see that the translating itself will work and it will translate the whole page for you can you see that can you see that it's giving me the fabric name it's giving me the the sewing it's giving me everything if i click on view more right now you see that the translator itself will work and it will translate every single thing over here to translate every single thing over here can you see that so to the ordering process so let me order it okay so your translator is always working i feel like this makes things very very easy especially if you are in the sourcing the sourcing stage like you are now looking for the items to buy you can use this to do it and if maybe you want to camera search you just go and do it on your um on your desktop so i want to select any products at all over here Okay. okay so let me just select this product okay so that's translated the page so can you see that it's giving me everything so shipping commitment 48 hour delivery return package and um, freight then optional message so if i want to send a message to this particular vendor here all i have to do is to click here now let me click and pay order submission okay okay so can you see that so once i click on so alipay can you see that can you see that i don't have amounts up to this 30 rmb I'll, I'll just input the my payment password and this payment is going to take through right so you can virtually do everything over here it's not only for the translating right so whatever you do on your app apart from using the image search you can be able to do all of that on this particular alipay app and you can be able to translate it very very easily i feel this actually helps a lot so that you can easily be able to do your sourcing so that we it's not now we'll be doing screenshots to go and now read then all of that so this brings us to the very end of this particular video if you found this video interesting please click on the like button also click on the subscribe button to join us i am organizing an importation training if you want to join the importation training too just dm me and we are actually going to talk about that so i'll see you next time it's bye bye